Hello and welcome to the award-winning Waterman Wellness, your pathway to whole person health, body, mind, and spirit. I'm your host, Alyssa Heritzik. We have plenty of healthful information from local experts, including a Mount Dora man says extensive research about a high-tech procedure to ease his pain has paid off. I feel more confident in doing things and in walking and, and going places. Did you know exercise can be a great way to stave off the flu? A Lake County specialist explains why. And this Eustace woman recognized early symptoms of a heart attack. You'll hear her story. It may help you one day. We begin this episode in New Year with a new look for Lake County's largest employer. It's official. Florida Hospital Waterman is now Advent Health Waterman. Recently, the Tavares Hospital unveiled its new brand and commitment to focus on whole person health. This focus encompasses a more personal level of care that emphasizes a physical, emotional, and spiritual approach to health. As part of the nationwide Advent Health Network, the local hospital and its 1,800 plus team members will continue its 80-year-old tradition of providing world-class health care for the Lake County community. Local consumers have access to a network of 80,000 physicians, specialists, and care members committed to guiding you on a journey of whole health. Visit AdventHealthWaterman.com to learn more about whole person health and what it means for you and your loved ones. Advent Health Waterman has another reason to celebrate. The Leapfrog Group, a national nonprofit organization, has recognized the hospital with another A rating for safety. This is the hospital's 11th consecutive top grade since 2013. It is the only hospital in Central Florida and one of six in the state to reach this achievement. The Leapfrog Hospital Safety Grade Panel uses 28 measurements of patient safety data to assign the grades to more than 2,600 hospitals across the country. You'll find more about the patient safety rating and what it means to you by visiting the website on your screen. Next, an important message from a Eustace woman who credits Advent Health Waterman's education efforts for helping save her life. I had a pain that went from my right ear, down my jaw, down the side of my neck a little bit. And then within a few minutes, I had a pain in my left arm. Carolyn Zelanti says she acted immediately because of a brochure she received at Advent Health Waterman after her husband's heart attack. My husband's symptoms when he had his heart attack were very different than mine. And it mentioned, it was like a whole circle of different things that you could be having a heart attack and the jaw pain was in there. And that's what made me think I'd better get to the hospital. The heart cath found that I had three blockages and they were severe enough that if I would have waited, I could have had a major heart attack. Then I met Dr. Moore and he explained the procedure to me. And of course I was scared as heck, but he's also a doctor that I had great faith in because he did my husband's heart surgery. When you're talking with a surgeon, it is beneficial to find out what their experience is in your particular problem and find out uh, if they've done a large number of cases of, of the type of problem that you have and what their results have been. I've been practicing heart surgery and lung surgery for over 20 years. I stopped counting cases after I reached around seven or 8,000. Zelanti says she has steadily increased her activity and is looking forward to getting back to work and going to Disney with her grandson. I wish that everyone who walked into the hospital would get a brochure and maybe you could save your own life. Advent Health Waterman is offering a number of community events to help you and your loved ones know about good heart health. The local February Heart Month observances begin on Friday, February 1st with the Ladies Hot Topic Breakfast. The free event includes engaging speakers and goodie bags. You must RSVP in advance. You and a loved one will want to make time to hear Dr. Miguel Bryce from Advent Health Waterman talk about treatment for arrhythmia or irregular heartbeats. The free seminar will be Thursday, February 21st at one o'clock. 
You'll find more details about Heart Month events, plus local cardiac health resources by visiting adventhealthheartwaterman.com. Prostate cancer patients are resuming normal activities sooner, thanks to advanced treatment available here in Lake County. John Spadaro's cancer diagnosis began with a simple blood test. My general practitioner found out through a PSA test that my PSA score was 4.2, which I came to understand is a little bit elevated. At the recommendation of a specialist, the Eustace man had surgery to remove the cancer. The doctor told me at that time, he said, you have a 40% chance of actually reoccurring cancer because of the positive margins. I heard him, but it didn't register. Spadaro was then referred to Dr. Anu Jain from Advent Health Waterman for targeted radiation therapy. With the latest generation of machines, uh, the treatment does get more accurate. Uh, many features of the machine are smoother, so the treatment process is, is faster and more comfortable for patients. I was very encouraged by him. He, he's a nice fella. I even asked him, I said, what, what makes you any different than any other cancer center? And he said, we're as good as any. And he says, we have the same machines they do. We have the newest machines. We have the, you know, a very knowledgeable staff. The whole process for me here, here at the facility that I'm at at Waterman has been very good. It's, it's been positive. The biggest part of it has been the people that, that I've been dealing with. They're very kind people. And uh, I'm very grateful they've been there to, to buoy me up with them and my wife and my family. You can learn more about advanced cancer treatment at Advent Health Waterman by visiting the website on your screen. Next, it's cold and flu season, and local specialists want to make sure you and your family are prepared. Dr. Veronica Chastain from Advent Health Waterman says the flu vaccine is the best way to protect against influenza viruses. There's probably 150 plus different strains, not only of influenza A, but also influenza B. Influenza A tends to be more resistant and that's why we create a vaccine every year, because we will target the strains that produce the most damage the year before. Influenza immunization becomes active 10 to 14 days after it has been given. So the American Academy of Family Practice recommends for all physicians to provide it to older patients as soon as it becomes available each year. Dr. Chastain says some people are especially at risk if they get the flu. Pneumonia can be caused by viruses as well as bacteria, and we do recommend for old elderly patients, especially patients with chronic illnesses 65 and above, to get both the pneumonia and the influenza immunization together because studies have shown that it decreases the risk for respiratory, cardiovascular, and cerebrovascular complications. Dr. Chastain says there's another way to help protect yourself from the flu. Studies have shown that elderly patients that remain active, that engage in aerobic exercise activity or do any sort of uh, physical therapy, especially balance training, actually get a higher titer after the influenza immunization for a prolonged period of time, usually up to 24 weeks, which will be pretty much the whole flu season. Need a partner to help you with whole person health? Visit adventhealthwaterman.com to find a specialist who can meet your needs. It's time to take a short break, but we'll have plenty more when Waterman Wellness continues. A Tavares orthopedic surgeon explains how robotic technology is helping patients recover quicker. There's nothing like being in the comfort of one's home after surgery or an illness. Stay tuned to learn about a specialized service that helps patients reach their recovery goals. And how about some healthy alternatives to your favorite meals? Join us in the Con Recreation Health Center kitchen to learn about sensational substitutes. Check out Waterman Wellness Magazine for even more health and wellness information. You can arrange for home delivery of the magazine by visiting watermanwellness.com. Plus, you'll find a listing of the specialists featured in this episode. Here are some community events you and your loved ones might want to check out. Don't go away. Waterman Wellness will return shortly. Now it's time for the Creation Health Tip of the Month. Those who volunteer experience great personal satisfaction. 
Today, offer your time in service to others. Welcome back to the award-winning Waterman Wellness, your pathway to whole person health, body, mind, and spirit. I'm Melissa Heritzik. Being active plays an important role in whole person health. In our next story, a Mount Dora man explains how a high-tech procedure corrected his joint pain and has him moving again. My knees started hurting back uh, probably around the uh, early 2000s, maybe 2005, 2006. And I went to a doctor and uh, he took some x-rays and basically said that I have bad arthritis in both my knees. I was getting a lot of pushback from family to just get this done. And when I found out that Dr. Guru was using this new procedure that Stryker Mako does, it's a robotic type of surgery. And I said, you know, I'm gonna look into that more. So I went and saw him and he explained the, uh, the procedure to me and I said, uh, okay, I'm sold. Basically what we do is we get a CT scan of the patient's anatomy whether it's a hip or a knee joint, and it's almost like a custom procedure for the patient. We use a robotic arm based off of the patient's CT scan to perform the procedure. With the help of the robotic arm, we're able to uh, ensure that there's very minimal bone loss, which makes the procedure very precise, restoring the patient's anatomical alignment, uh, and of course, ensures a faster recovery for the patient. They had me up and uh, moving about uh, within a couple of hours after the surgery. I feel more confident in doing things, in walking and, and going places. And uh, you know, every day is a little challenge, but every day it gets easier. Pain is a pretty debilitating condition. If patients can't move or do the things they need to do, it certainly affects their quality of life. So orthopedically, when we're able to fix a patient's joint, they're able to return to their activities, which obviously makes their quality of life a lot better. If pain interferes with your normal activity, visit adventhealthorthowaterman.com to learn about advanced treatment available locally. Sometimes patients will require additional help at home after surgery or hospitalization. Doctors may recommend specialized care to help a patient through recovery. Carol Fuller's doctor referred home care services for her after knee surgery. It's such a new thing for me not to be able to walk around real quickly and do for myself. The Mount Dora woman called Advent Health Waterman Home Care Services to help. Skilled services are typically covered by Medicare and other insurance. So we have a full service line of therapy that can provide services, physical therapy, occupational therapy, and speech therapy that can really work with the patient in their home setting to get them back to where they can function as independent as possible and be able to remain at home. She walked through and uh, warned me about the steps and the rugs. They've been there, they've done it before, so they know what to expect. And that's, that's, that's one of their biggest assets, I would say. When we first go out to admit a patient or to evaluate a patient, we're really looking at how they function in the home what are their needs, and also what is the patient's goal? Because that's really important when we develop our plan of care that we are meeting the patient's goal as well as the medical goals that um, the physician has asked us to address. We have an opportunity in home care to really embrace the patient with whole person care because we are in their home. It's just a perfect setting for us to provide that care that Advent Health is known for. Visit the website on your screen to learn about the Joint Commission accredited home care services at Advent Health Waterman. We're introducing a new segment in Waterman Wellness. You'll learn ways you and your family can feel whole with the focus on easy. Recently, I visited the Conry Creation Health Center kitchen where an Advent Health Waterman expert introduced me to healthy alternate ingredients. So you may have decided to start eating healthier with your family. I'm here today with Advent Health Waterman dietitian Peter Weiss, and he's going to talk with us about some healthy substitutions for some of our favorite foods. 
Hi, Peter. Thanks for being with us today. Hi, Alyssa. Thank you for having me. You're welcome. So we're here to talk about some different substitution items that I have. We have riced cauliflower, we have sour cream and Greek yogurt, and then we have a variety of pasta options as well. So let's start with the cauliflower, Peter. What would that be a good substitute for? So if you're a fan of mashed potatoes, but maybe you want to reduce your carbohydrates, rice cauliflower is a great option. Okay. You can use it just like mashed potatoes, and you can buy it in the frozen food section, but you can also get it in the produce section. So are there are certain conditions this would be especially beneficial for? Yes, for someone with diabetes, this is a great option because it's lower carbohydrate. And also, it has more protein and fiber, which will allow them to feel fuller during their meals. Okay, makes sense. So sour cream is something I love to use in most of my recipes, or even as a condiment or a dip. And I understand maybe you have a substitution for that as well? Yes, we have Greek yogurt here is a great option. It's a whole milk Greek yogurt. And it's very comparable in taste to the sour cream, but it's significantly better as far as being lower fat, lower cholesterol, lower saturated fat while having more protein and also probiotics. The great thing is you can substitute it out for things like tacos, for dip, chips and dip, it's a great option as well. So actually the sour cream is 40 grams of fat for the whole container, while the Greek yogurt is only about 10 grams. So it's about a quarter of the fat content versus the sour cream. So everybody loves pasta, it's so easy to cook with, but I understand you have several different healthier options for us. If you want to have pasta but you don't want to have the carbohydrates with it, you can reduce it by using something like a chickpea pasta or a red lentil pasta. You can even go and use something like a spiralized vegetable. Those are great, but they're, the spiralized vegetables are lower protein. And so you're going to find that if you do use that as an alternative, you'll still be hungry. So you should probably use a lean protein with that. And so is there any additional nutritional value in using like a red lentil pasta as opposed to a regular pasta? Yeah, the red lentil pasta is fantastic. It has almost twice the protein content. It has more fiber. It's lower carbohydrate. So especially for someone that's managing diabetes or someone that's looking to reduce their calorie consumption a little bit, it's a great option as, as an alternative. And if I don't want my family to know I have substituted something healthier, are they going to notice a difference? The textures of these will be a little bit denser than the regular pasta, so it'll be a little bit more to chew through. But taste-wise, it tastes phenomenal and it, it does really well with a nice pasta sauce. The big thing here that I want to emphasize is that by using these alternatives, it's a great way for people to increase their vegetable consumption, in, increase the variety in their diet, and give them better options so that they're not stuck eating the same thing day after day. Thank you, Peter. Thank you. For more ways you can learn about whole person health, visit adventhealthwaterman.com. We hope you've enjoyed this episode of Waterman Wellness, your pathway to whole person health, body, mind, and spirit. Be sure to watch for the next episode right here on Lake Sumter TV for some of the following stories. A Mount Dora man shares how spirituality played an important role in his treatment for a serious heart condition. A Tavares surgeon addresses common concerns about colonoscopies. It's information you don't want to miss. And did you know certain foods work better together for your health? Tune in to find out about Tasty Teamwork. To learn more about the experts featured in this program, please visit watermanwellness.com. Until next time, I'm Melissa Hritzik for the award-winning Waterman Wellness.